And who are you here with? I'm with my mum and my girlfriend. Quite a few. And who's your biggest fan? Who's your biggest supporter? My dad. Definitely. Is he? Yeah. What, more than your mum? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I am! I didn't think he was here. <laughs> you didn't know he was here? I thought he was working. He's gone to bits now. He works, he works away from home a lot. And uh, whenever I play, play anywhere, he'll, he'll always come. Oh, he surprised. He surprised him. All right, Ruben. Well, look, <laughs> it's now a family occasion. Now, tell me what you're going to sing. I'm going to sing my own song called Lifeline. I wrote it about a year ago, and it's about my girlfriend. I didn't really treat right. And uh, it's, it's an apology, really. Wow. So did you dump her? Simon! No. <laughs> I don't know. No, uh, she dumped me. <laughs> OK, so you got her back, and this song is to her. This song's to her. Good luck. <laughs> Thank you very much. To bruise your heart I'm so sorry it drove us this far apart Drowning in a sea full of tears I thought we could have lasted for years and I still do want to live my life with you. And so throw me, throw me a lifeline, baby. Say that I'm really sorry. Pick up the phone. Expectations I will defy Girl, I'm begging on my knees Come on, come on, baby, please So throw me, throw me a lifeline, baby Say that I'm really sorry Pick up the phone Five years ago, we never imagined that she would be here today. When Angelica was four years old, she started coughing and having fevers. We brought her into the emergency room, and that's when we found out she had double pneumonia, and her kidney stopped working. Sweet creature. Things were getting really bad really fast. They brought in a chaplain to talk with us. We thought that we're about to lose her. Don't know where we're going, what saved her life is she got her kidney transplant from her mother. Well, what did mommy give you? Mommy gave me her kidney. Oh, mommy gave you her kidney. Oh, let's hug mommy. She's my hero. <laughs> it's her dream to become a singer. Her being here today is a miracle. If I won America's Got Talent, I would get a puppy. I would get a puppy, like a small thing. Let's go.
What's your name? My name is Angelica Hale. And where are you from? I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. Atlanta, Georgia. How old are you? I'm nine years old. And I just found out that I'm going to be a big sister. Wow! Mama! Who do you want to be like? I want to be the next Whitney Houston. Wow! I want to be a superstar. Wow. And I'm so happy to be here because, like, I've been watching your show on YouTube, and now I feel like, like, I'm in it, and I'm, like, so, yeah. like, awestruck. And not only are you in it, you're in it to... To win it! Yeah! Woo! Woo! Yeah! Well, little girl. Go ahead, Angelica. Okay. Win it for you. yourself. Thank you. You're welcome. Whitney Houston. You're broken down and tired I will give it life on a merry-go-round And you can't find the fighter wow. But I see it in you, so we're gonna walk it out And move shouldn't actually happen. <laughs> you're tiny, your voice is huge. I have a feeling we may be looking at a star in the future. Thank you. Heidi. Wow, I had goosebumps everywhere. You're a clever little girl and you said you want to be a superstar. I think that might happen for you. Let me tell you. LB. You are so special and your voice is so amazing. Thank you so much for sharing this with us today. By the way, Mel B, you're my favorite judge. Yes. Go and give me a hug. You are so good. You're all going so well. Angelica, you said you've been watching this on YouTube and you felt like now you're in it. I believe that not only are you in it, I predict that all your dreams are going to come true, young lady. 
Mel, vote. Oh, yes, a million times over. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you. Ivy. Of course it's a yes. A big fat yes. Simon. Who did you say your favorite judge was? Me. Look, I mean... <laughs> Angelica, you are absolutely brilliant. Love you. I'm, I'm honored that I'm your favorite judge as well. You've got three yeses. <laughs> so you got three yeses. I'm going to give you your fourth. You have four yeses. <laughs> One of his, I want everyone to like me, Dave. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. Hello there. Hello. What's your name? My name's Kyle Tomlinson. Nice to meet you, Kyle. Nice to meet you too. Where are you from, my darling? Sheffield. Sheffield. <laughs> and how old are you? I'm 15. Okay, Carl, so tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, I'm sorry, I'm really nervous. I can tell, that's okay. Take your time. It's all right. Um, well, I came a couple of years ago and I got told to get a singing teacher and... Who told you that? David? Yeah. Me? Oh, okay. <laughs> that doesn't sound like the kind of sensible thing I'd say. <laughs> Was it said it quite harshly? Yeah. Really? And Kyle, how old were you when he said that to you? Twelve. Oh. Twelve? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Boo. Yeah, boo, boo, boo. Well, I'm shocked. So, presumably, for the last couple of years, you've been working with a teacher? Yeah. And you're feeling more confident now? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Do you need a little sip of water or something before you start? David, David, David. Don't Too late for that. <laughs> <laughs> Too late. You try everything you can to be nice now. What did the you others nice say? Then. What did the others say? They were quite nice. Were they? <laughs> well, I was the... I this was, is strange. I was the mean one. Yeah. I'm the only nice one here. Oh, that's a lie. Kyle, anyway, I'm we're sure. here to support you, Carl, so good luck. Here's your chance to Thank prove you. David wrong. <laughs> what did they say? Did Thank you. Come on, son. Can do it. <clears throat> I heard there was a secret chord, David played and it pleased the Lord. But you don't really care for music. Do ya? Well, it goes like this the fourth, the fifth, the minor fall, and the major league, the baffle king, compassion, hallelujah. Sounds great, doesn't it? Baby, baby. 
stood up there, you put your heart and soul on the line, and we all felt it, and we were all there with you. That was brilliant. You know, this just shows you, Kyle, when someone grinds you down and says, you're not good enough, you come back, and you come back and look them in the eye, and you go, I am good enough. Thank you. David, what did you think? I thought it was really good. Well done. And you know what? You've sung with real passion. And that's what it's all about. Thank you so much. Thank you. You gave every single ounce you could possibly give to that performance. Well done. Well done. Kyle. It was a really, really moving performance, and I'm really glad you came back and proved me wrong. Thank you. <laughs> you like that? I really loved that. I really loved it. We will see you live in the studio. <laughs> that is a dream. That's like a fairy tale, isn't it? Yeah, that really is. Impossible. Hello. What's your name, please? Um, my name's Harry Gardner. How old are you? I'm 16. Where are you from, Harry? Um, I'm from Essex. OK. So, tell me why you've decided to enter this show. I just want to kind of share my music with other people and see if they can relate. OK. And, Harry, what are you going to sing for us today? Um, the song I'm going to sing is a song that I've written. Um, it's a song for my nan. Um, and it's a song called Not Alone. My nan, she was diagnosed with Alzheimer's three years ago. Oh. Yeah, this song's a tribute for her. Has she heard this song before, Harry? Um, yeah, I did play it to her. Um, she wasn't really, like, aware of what was going on. She looked happy, which was just nice. OK, well, I can't wait to hear it. Good luck. Thank you very much. Open your eyes And tell me what you see Am I among the forgotten? Please say you remember me We know you're there Somewhere inside I say a prayer for you to smile Looks like the angels Owe me one today But I stay strong I know it won't be long Till I see the old days Open your eyes and say hello Open your mind and just let go Tell me to get the remote So we can watch your favourite show And ruffle my hair and say it's bad And tell me this chocolate in your handbag Tell me just how much I've grown And let me know I'm not alone and we understand that good things don't last but I'd give anything just to hear you laugh Looks like the angels owe me one today But I stay strong, I know it won't be long Till we see the old days Open your eyes and say hello Open your mind and just let go Tell me to get the remote 
so we can watch your favorite show and ruffle my hair and say it's bad and tell me this chocolate in your handbag tell me just how much i've grown and let me know i'm not alone and let me know i'm not alone thank you Hello. Hi, how are you? And what's your name? Uh, Mandy Harvey. And who's this? My interpreter. What's your name? Sarah. Nice to meet you, Sarah. Nice to meet you, you, Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Doing well, thank you. Hello. Okay, Mandy, so I think I've worked this out. So you're deaf? Yes, I, I lost all my hearing when I was 18 years old. Wow, and how old are you now? Uh, 29, so it's 10 years. Wow. And Mandy, how did you lose your hearing, if you don't mind me asking? I have a connective tissue disorder, so basically I got sick and my nerves deteriorated. So, you were singing before you lost your hearing? Yeah, I've been singing since I was four. So I, I left music after I lost my hearing and then uh, figured out how to get back into singing with muscle memory, using visual tuners, and trusting my pitch. So your shoes are off because you're feeling the vibration. Is that how you're following the music? Yeah, I'm feeling the tempo, the, the beat, uh, through the floor. And Mandy, what are you going to sing? I'm going to uh, sing a song that I wrote called Try. Okay, can you tell me what it's about? After I lost my hearing, I gave up. But I want to do more with my life than just give up. So. Good for you. Okay, well, look, this is your moment, and good luck. Uh, okay. I don't think you're going to need a translator for this.
a long time. That was one of the most amazing things I've ever seen and heard. Come here. Thank you. Honestly, I never think I'm going to be surprised or amazed by people. And then you turn up. And with, I mean, just the fact that you are you, but it was your voice, your tone. The song was beautiful. Congratulations, you are straight through to the live shows. <laughs> Mandy, you know what? We found each other. Yes. And you can tell everything I love you. This is a song. And maybe quite a simple thing. But that is done. Hey, YouTube, thanks for watching. If you like this and you want to see a lot more, all you got to do is click right here to subscribe. This is amazing. I think I feel a little viral. Hello. And what's your name? Uh, Mandy Harvey. And who's this? My interpreter. What's your name? Sarah. Nice to meet you, Sarah. Nice to meet you, Sarah. Hi, Sarah. Doing well, thank you. Hello. Okay, Mandy, so I think I've worked this out. So you're deaf? Yes, I, I lost all my hearing when I was 18 years old. Wow. And how old are you now? Uh, 29. So it's 10 years. Wow. And Mandy, how did you lose your hearing, if you don't mind me asking? I have a connective tissue disorder, so basically I got sick and my nerves deteriorated. So, you were singing before you lost your hearing? Yeah, I've been singing since I was four. So I, I left music after I lost my hearing and then uh, figured out how to get back into singing with muscle memory, using visual tuners, and trusting my pitch. So your shoes are off because you're feeling the vibration. Is that how you're following the music? Yeah, I'm feeling the tempo, the, the beat, uh, through the floor. And Mandy, what are you going to sing? I'm going to uh, sing a song that I wrote called Try. OK, can you tell me what it's about? After I lost my hearing, I gave up. But I want to do more with my life than just give up. So. Good for you. OK, well, look, this is your moment, and good luck. Uh, OK.
Andy, I don't think you're going to need a translator for this. Honestly, I never think I'm going to be surprised or amazed by people. And then you turn up. And with, I mean, just the fact that you are you, but it was your voice, your tone. The song was beautiful. Congratulations, you are straight through to the live shows. <laughs> Mandy, you know what? We found each other. Yes. And you can tell everything's <laughs> like me. This is a song. And maybe quite a simple thing. And then it's done. Hey, YouTube, thanks for watching. If you like this and you want to see a lot more, all you got to do is click right here to subscribe. This is amazing. I think I feel a little viral.